Hey there, Amy here. Congratulations on your new promotion to iWire Scout. Welcome to the next level of iWire. In this Scout's you know, intro video, I'm going to show you how to use your new powers in iWire. So let's take a look. So first of all, you'll notice that you have access to some new heat maps at the bottom. So you can see created, you can see low weight, and you can also see, dun dun dun, psych vision. For the purpose of this video, we're going to be working with the Scythe Vision heat map. Now this heat map shows you how other scouts, scythes, and admins have marked certain cubes. You can look at this heat map legend at the bottom of your screen to see what each color represents. You'll also notice that you have a new toolbox if you hit the shift key. You have some buttons that do some special things. So let me first just minimize um, minimize the leaderboard over there, stop the cell from spinning so that my computer will load a little faster. Now, let's take a look at the buttons in this, tool, in this toolbox. You've got H, F, and I. Highlight, flag, and inspect. If you forget what these buttons do, just hover over them and they'll give you the full name of the button and also its keyboard shortcut. Now, on the right-hand side of the panel, you see a bunch of information um, about the cube. So let me just click on a cube so that it will have some actual information to fill in, to fill in and populate this box. Um, so you just click anywhere on the cell and then the cube you selected is marked with a white bounding box. Now you can see a whole bunch of data about this cube. Um, you can see you know, weight, ID, children, parents, and you can also see the players who have done that cube. Um, now, as a scout, the main thing that you're going to be doing is going in and inspecting and trying to find places where the overall players have like missed something hard or added a merger in. Um, and it's important generally to not inspect cubes with a weight lower than three as they won't yet have an accurate consensus. If an admin, a scout, or a scythe has flagged the cube, so let me click one of the cubes that has been flagged, you'll see that the, the different statuses of the players show up in a different color in this menu. Now, let's try out some of your new tools. Using the, to use the highlight key, um, let's uh, select a cube in the overview, and I'm going to highlight the branch below the cube, which the branches above the cube, we call these the parents and the children. You can just click the buttons again to toggle them on and off. This is really helpful for keeping your place in the cell. The next button is flag. So you're going to use this button to indicate that a cube has a problem that needs to be looked at. So there's something missing or there's a merger in it. But well, once you click the button, your selected cube will turn yellow. Now before you flag a cube, you always want to inspect it. So let's try that. Hit enter and boom, you can pop straight into this cube. And now that you're inside the cube, you'll see the cube's current consensus. Now this cube apparently has a load of little pieces that took a minute to load, but this means that you are seeing all the segments that people who have played the cube agree upon. To inspect the cube, um, you just are going to kind of look at the current trace and see if there's anything missing. This cube looks perfect, nothing needs to be added, so you can hit the escape key or you can just click going, click overview and return right back in. All right, so here we are in Bonus Lightning 67A, and we have discovered by inspecting in the overview a nasty merger that needs to be flagged to draw the sides. We're going to go hit enter to inspect the cube, and sure enough, that scraggly little pink branch is a merger. So what I'm going to do with my new scout powers is I'm going to take a screenshot of this cube, I'm going to flag the cube, and then I'm going to log the screenshot in the scout's log with a note that the thin pink branch is the merger and needs to be removed. So as soon as I hit flag the cube, it's going to say, are you sure? I am certain. I'm going to hit submit, and then that cube will be flagged, and the scythe's attention will be drawn to this cube, and then they can come in, swoop in, and get rid of that merger. And that's it. That is using your scout powers in action.